This luxury bus unveiled today is targeting leisure passengers of all shades who desire to tour Kampala city and its associated sites. Anchored on tourism, a development Katikiro Charles Maiga is lauding. It's a good innovation and I urge everyone to uh, embrace tourism starting with domestic tourism. Many people when you talk about tourism think of flying to Europe or to Asia but I think the best thing would be to start with what you have and we have plenty of things that need to be seen. We need to showcase them, we need to promote them and I think this is a very good starting point. State Minister for Tourism Godfrey Chiwanda adds that this half a billion shilling luxury bus will not run into the headwinds of Kampala's perpetual traffic jam. We have a lead car. We have our lead cars as the Minister of Tourism and of course under police, under Uganda police, and you see them as tourism police. So if you, your people want to be as quick as possible in our city, we, have, we, we can also uh, solve that problem of the traffic jam. Promote Uganda, the private sector players behind the double-deck travel bus say they are keeping their fingers crossed on its profitability. This bus is pretty expensive. It is over 500 million. And then um, when you add on taxes, it certainly goes beyond that. So what we've done is uh, we have had to borrow some money to invest in this investment. We think if it is well marketed, we should be able to recoup the investment. City hotels known for compressing are expected to offer supply of leisure travelers interested in touring Kampala at a cost of $30 or approximately 100,000 shillings for 14 sightseeing including Kasobi tombs and the Uganda Museum. Reina Ojun, NTV Business.